Welcome to the data mining for e-commerce case study. Now in this case study we're going to assess uh, a couple different brands. The first one being Neiman Marcus, the online retailer, luxury goods. All right. And what I wanted to show you in this uh, example, for example, we're mining customer favorites. All right. You can see the first column is showing the picture of the item, then the brand, and then the item with with a link to the actual item. Now I know most people show you Amazon, and we're going to do that as well within Data Jacker. However, this is kind of uh, beyond the box thinking. Now these are all customer favorites. People, you know, these are the brands and the items that people most favorited, most uh, bought, okay? And now this is ahead of, uh, you know, the Christmas and uh, buying season, okay? The holiday buying season. So, you know, obviously, um, as a re as a as a local retailer and or as an online retailer or as an affiliate, we all want to find out you know what's uh, what's being bought and uh, wished for in real time. So this is a, a wonderful way to do that uh, by way of data mining. Okay, so here we have the customer favorites. You know, in a couple sections, which are the jewelry and uh, you know the women's shoes. You can see the brands. You can see which brands you know are, you know come up a lot. You know, uh, I can tell you Christian. Louboutin, you know, I'm saying it right, you know, uh, it's a high end true, okay. Then we have, uh, you know, uh, Lulu DK, you know, you can see a lot of uh, low hanging fruits that you would not uh, kind of guesstimate ahead of time, okay, both for the item description as well as the brands, okay. See, you know, what, what people like, and also obviously in terms of the actual item, the actual pictures, okay, and go check them out yourself. Now, you, uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you how easy it is to. Uh, kind of add a you know category or a page from a category and we you know we're going to add you know very popular for for women we're doing it right now in real time you can see that uh it's going to be uh, bags. You can see that, you know, it added, you know, the, the first one is, uh, uh, you know, again, uh, Christian Louboutin uh, shoe, right? That's like, a, I think it's uh, one of those uh, uh, Sex in the City uh, shoes. Uh, uh, I think Manolo Blahnik, that's, that's more like it, but, and they have them as well somewhere. Uh, and then we have, you know, the Tony Birch uh the the bag okay and then we have some jewelry and uh, shoes and then another uh, philip lim uh, bag and so forth and so on again this is from neiman marcos okay and we're going to go into uh further further investigation of kind of higher end brands and different sources uh beyond amazon which most people do again you can get ideas for you know i know a lot of uh, people do what's called uh fulfillment by amazon the fba program so you can get ideas of what's working you know and what's not you know whether you want to sell via amazon as an affiliate via amazon you know fba program via ebay via etsy via a whole bunch of uh different other sources what's what's actually working right now because this is again these are customer favorites in real time this is real time data okay now the next uh the next demo that we're going to see we're going to see uh something a little uh different kind of out of the box thinking that uh, i hope you like as well okay hold on one second and we're back now in this uh, case all right we're looking at uh, a data data that we mine from a company by the name of Bergdorf Goodman which is another high-end uh, retailer again I, I I'll show you within the membership of data jacker exactly where I got this information this is real time kind of you know who's who in the, the luxury data sphere of uh, uh, you know of, of, of retail okay uh, now Instead of uh, going after customer favorites in this case, I'm looking at the new arrivals. All right, what what this tells me? Okay, now let me give you kind of a, a, a preview. You know, you know, every one of these companies has, uh, you know, what's called uh, you know buyers. Okay, and they, you know, they're responsible or buyer teams. You know, they're responsible for assessing, you know, the market probably six months. To, to a year to see what's what's hot, what's what's trending, what what the what the clients will want in real time for for the next uh, few months and uh, beyond. All right. So if I'm if I'm 
if I want to kind of be ahead of the trend, I want to see kind of the new arrivals because the new arrivals are obviously somebody already did the research for us. And, uh, you know, and then, you know, so we can be ahead of the of the curve, so to speak, in this uh, market. And like I said, this is this is uh, the first the first category that you see in front of you is uh, obviously like uh, beauty products. And you can see that La Mer, La Mer is a big, uh, a big uh, company or Bobby Brown, Tom Ford. You know, etc. Hannah, Hannah, Mori, Donna, Karen. All right. Now we can see again. This is for the same kind of. Uh, why? Do, why do we need this data? Okay, to assess. Okay, before time, what the trending, uh, you know, uh, products will be for. You know the upcoming holiday season, okay? Whether you're an affiliate, whether you have your own local shop, whether you're selling online yourself, etc. Now, you know, like I said, these companies are large companies, luxury goods uh, uh, retailers, etc. You know, they did they, they have teams that did a lot of research for for you, for us. To, to assess uh, what's going on. And I'm gonna refresh, I'm gonna add a couple other categories that you can see. This is uh, beauty, and then I think uh, we'll see in a second accessories. It's, it's doing it real time, so bear with me. Okay, here we go. So we, you know, we we have the uh, you know accessories, and we have uh, at the, uh, women's uh, again women's uh, uh, shoes and boots and so forth. And you know, in between that, we have the the other uh, data that we gathered before, which was the beauty. So again, we can see uh, again this is in real time. You can see that it changed even. You know, because we can see that uh, the first one before was La Mer. Now it's Eve uh, Saint Laurent. Uh, bouquet, you know, which is some, uh, it's a palette of multi usage, uh, you know, like, uh, I guess it's uh, makeup. But you can see the brands Fendi, Stuart Weitzman, which is a, you know, a shoe brand, Alexander McQueen, which, you know, this is a more of a, uh, scarf, you know, which is an accessory, you know, uh, you have glasses by Givenchy, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Like I said, I'm not going to name drop all these guys' uh, names. I'm not making any, uh, you know, uh, sponsorship deals with these guys. However, you can see, you, and also you can see uh, in terms of pricing analysis, you can see what your what your uh, products uh, that you're trying to sell, you know, again, whether you're an affiliate, whether you have a local shop or you're an online retailer, you can see specifically, does my f price fit within uh, this category and how does it compare to this uh, retailer? And again, we can uh, mix and match different types of retailers with it within uh data jacker and also within you know when we download uh, this data uh in real time again for uh, you know for usage uh for our own purposes okay so with that i hope you enjoyed the kind of out of the box thinking again we looked at uh customer favorites and in this case we looked at new arrivals again these are all research products like i said these are all, all companies who are high end who have buyer teams who kind of you know are in the field and know exactly what's what's uh being demanded ahead of time, ahead of the curve, okay? So with that, I bid you farewell. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Kind regards, Ron.